Batman Brave and the Bold is coming. It will be the first Batman film in a relaunched universe and will be released in DCU's Chapter 1. Gods and Monsters Chapter 1 will also consist of Superman, Legacy, Paradise Lost, Booster Gold, and Swamp Thing. Here is everything we know about Brave and the Bold so far. Let's make one aspect clear. Despite the shock ending of George Clooney as Bruce Wayne at the end of The Flash, he will not be Batman despite scattered rumors. The case was otherwise. This new Batman will be distinct from previous iterations. He will be a slightly older, more experienced Batman with the shocking introduction of his son, Damian Wayne. James Gunn has mentioned the story will be inspired from Grant Morrison's Batman run, which introduced Damian Wayne in the comics. The name The Brave and Bold is from a 1955 series where Batman teamed up with other heroes. Damian Wayne is the son of Talia al Ghul and Bruce Wayne, although in the comics and animated features, Bruce is not aware of his son until much later. Damian Wayne is incredibly talented and trained by the League of Shadows at an early age. He was trained by killers and eventually is raised by someone with a no-kill rule. This is a battle he has to fight as he embarks on his crime-fighting journey as Robin. The father-son Batman and Robin relationship will establish a new dynamic different from previous film iterations. This goes hand-in-hand hand with the brave and bold title. We know this will be a collaborative film with DC leadership and the director, Andy Muschietti. Andy Muschietti, Andy, as you may remember, directed the Flash film. It had a decent reception, but bombed in the box office. James Gunn stated the film was one of the best comic book movies he has ever seen and clearly believes that considering the directing announcement, it has been stated that Batman will be older than Superman, although we don't know how much of the gap will be. James Gunn has previously stated he believes Batman Begins is not a good film, was not a fan of Batman 89, and thinks The Dark Knight is overrated. So we can presume this film will take a different tone than these films. As far as who will play Batman, it will not be Ben Affleck, George Clooney, or Robert Pattinson. There will be a new casting decision for Batman and will presumably be announced shortly after the actor's strike ends. Actors being considered according to circulating rumors include Aaron Taylor, Johnson, Jensen Ackles, Michael Fassbender, Ben Barnes, and Jake Gyllenhaal. We will let you know everything about this film as news unfolds. Be sure to subscribe to the page for more.